Yo, Rich Paul came out and said that LeBron will remain with the Los Angeles Lakers and he is not requesting a trade. Like, it's crazy that the agent has to come out and say this because of the guy who predicted some major moves in the NBA. He had Kawhi going to the Clippers. I think he called LeBron to Miami and LeBron back to Cleveland. Like, they're trying to say this guy don't know what he's talking about or they just want to keep shit hush or don't want to let us know it's too early or there's going to be something really big happening. Whatever the case is, <laughs> Rich Paul had to come out and say that LeBron James is not requesting a trade and will remain with the Los Angeles Lakers for the remainder of the season. Isn't LeBron James a free agent after this year? And will he not have a trade clause throughout the entirety of this, what was it, a two-year contract extension that he had? So with him being a free agent this year, the trade deadline is in five days, six days. What you going to do? Or what are you going to do? I can't wait to see to the trade deadline. I can't wait to see what happens on the day of the trade deadline. I still think um, the Jonte Murray could be on the move, but he's now connected with a number of different teams. I even see Kyle Lowry, his name being tossed around with the Lakers. Like, I can't wait because I want all the teams to lock in and run towards the playoff or go for the playoff push. I think the best basketball is played when there are a ton of teams that are vying for the playoff push or vying for uh, seeding. That's when I think the best basketball is played.